Now, Russia is set to resume deliveries of its state-of-the-art air defense system to Iran. Vladimir Putin has signed a decree that ends a five-year-old embargo. Now, let's uh, get more details from RT's Medina Kochnova. So, Medina, what uh, has prompted this move? Uh, tell us more. Well, the uh, necessity for the embargo on S-300 air defense systems has fallen away as a result of uh, relations with Iran improving and of a recent breakthrough that was reached in Switzerland over Tehran's nuclear program. Now, that's according to Russia's foreign minister, Sergei Lavrov. Now, the contract for supplying the S-300 was uh, first signed back, uh, was signed eight years ago, but then in uh, 2010, uh, the embargo was was introduced in a bit to uh, stimulate the talks between the six world powers and Iran over its nuclear program. And currently, the Russian president, Vladimir Putin, has given a go-ahead for delivery as the sides are getting closer to reaching a final agreement and lifting sanctions. Now, the Russian uh, foreign minister, Sergei Lavrov, uh, said that Iran needs the S-300 due to quite a tense situation in the region, and uh, he also stress that the equipment in question is purely defensive and it represents no threat to nearby countries including Israel. Now and at the moment all eyes are on Israel and its reaction on the news considering the fact that uh, the country always saw Iran as its main enemy. Armadine, right, thanks so much for bringing us uh, the details and of course uh, we are monitoring the developments connected to this.